And welcome once again to another fantastic episode of Atomic Tutorials. In today's video, we are going to be making ED, the DuraFrame iBot, as found in Fallout New Vegas. For those in the know, ED is one of the many companions you can get in Fallout New Vegas and has a pivotal role in the Lonesome Road DLC. So yeah, that's what we're going to be building. So I think without further ado, let's get in to the block list. Okay, so for the ED DuraFrame iBot build, you'll need the following block materials. Grey concrete, mud blocks, polished deep slate stairs, Science terracotta, glass furnaces, regular furnaces, light grade concrete, stone slabs, polished andesite slabs, polished andesite stairs, stone brick walls, grindstones, white concrete, smooth sandstone, oak stairs, oak slabs, acacia trapdoors, white terracotta, yellow terracotta, red terracotta, and stone blocks, so those are the blocks you'll need for today's build. Now, for any of my survival players, uh, this build is very rich in light grade concrete and of course stone. Um, everything else is more of a kind of one block detail variety of item, so please make sure to look out for that. Okay, so with the block list out of the way, I think it's time to get in to our time lapse.
and we are back from that amazing time lapse folks but before i show you anything else i just want to say if you do like what i do please like this video and subscribe now to say that i have spurs that jingle jangle jingle when i see this build is no exception to the fact <laughs> I am very pleased with how this came out. Um, so for people in the know, I have actually done a Fallout 4 iBot tutorial. So this wasn't too hard in terms of modeling. You're essentially making the same model, but adding little details onto it. Uh, the main detail being this uh, wonderful sort of uh, adapted frame on the back, uh, maybe an engine or sort of some sort. It's a really interesting design choice, at least for my opinion, and of course the opinion of the Obsidian team. But overall, ED has fared very well over the years, being very much a post-war creation uh, of course you can see that on the uh, bumper stickers that are on the side uh, we've got um, Roosevelt Academy on one and some sort of uh, license plate on the other it's a really nice uh, design choice at least in my opinion now the modifications to ED are as follows uh, she's got a little uh, radar dish on the front uh, a lot of extra antennas um, obviously like I said before the advanced frame uh, the dura frame I believe it's called on the back of her chassis and of course a upgraded laser cannon underneath her main kind of radio uh, face so to speak since this is very much an airborne build it can go pretty much anywhere in the world um, if you are building it so please bear that in mind okay so that has been our atomic tutorial ed from fallout new vegas i do hope you enjoyed this this was a lot of fun to make um, not only because of the default modifications but because of this the sheer nostalgia of having such a character being built as one of my atomic tutorials so i just want to thank you so much for watching this video if you do like what i do please like this video and subscribe my name has been dr wasabi i bid you a most pleasant good evening and of course, as always, God bless. And now, folks, it is time to say good night. We sincerely appreciate your viewing and hope we've succeeded in providing you with an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Stay happy and come back again soon. Good night.